Hi! If you'd like to see me paint this cap and talk about fashion school, keep watching because I'm going to do that in just a minute. I wanted to finally celebrate graduation, so I painted this cap and I got all dressed in something I made at school. This was a really cool project that I did for like a fashion show. And then this is a romper I made to be Ramona Flowers. And I'm just dressed up for graduation. So I have a graduation cap. Yeah. Take a weapon. Unboxing. Wow. Oh. Jesus. 20 and 15. And they're very similar. Complementary, I mean, triad. Primary colors. I'm excited. I'm gonna have a comic book on my grad cap. Honestly, this is just like cheap fabric wrapped around a cardboard square. And it would be really easy to sew. And it's honestly beating the system. It's like pay $50 for this thing that costs three cents to make. Yeah, I'm definitely doing zombies, big brains, school big brain graduation cap, zombie fashion school. That's what I'm doing. I just want to be like Sophie from House of the Castle. Be like an old lady sitting next to the ocean saying, like, when you're old, you can just like look at the scenery and see how beautiful it is and not be worried with like your busy day. You can just like look at the world passing you by. Just like enjoy it and it doesn't make you sad anymore. That's goals. So I've like talked about it that I've graduated like a hundred times now, but I felt like I haven't actually like acknowledged it myself. Like I didn't walk at graduation even though I wanted to. A lot of people from my um, like <sighs> category of school study, um, like fashion students, a lot of people a lot of the fashion students were all graduating. Like there were like 20 of us in 2020 graduating. And there was usually only like, like eight or like around like five to eight. I don't know, like five, five to uh, 10 every year. The most was the first year and it was like 11 students. And so we like, double the first year where they had like the most fashion students because it was like the newest fashion program in like the midwest which can we just talk about how there's like no fashion program in the midwest besides the one i went to in salt lake city which is part of a community college and people like look down on that why is there no other fashion school in the midwest it's like literally mind well. I did graduate with like a lot of other students in the same like degree or whatever which is rare for my school like usually you just know a couple people graduating from the fashion group and you're all yay we did it but this year it was like a ton of people graduating and it was so much fun to be in like the collections class and we were just like all working on our collection and like helping each other. Like, I was lucky to have the chance to show my collection in January. And I was gonna show it again, and like, I was so excited to see everyone's collection. It was gonna be like this massive show, like no one's ever seen it before from our school. Like, 20 people showing a collection. Including, I think my teacher of the collection class was, who is a fashion designer and was showing a collection this year, maybe, I don't remember, but, um, so we were kind of like, it was so many of us, and it was like such a good time. So what's interesting is, at the end of this month, 
in the beginning of next month, we're doing our collections now. Now that now that we can get tested and like it's a little bit safer and like classes are open at my school and like people are doing fashion classes and they're actually inviting the 2020 senior class to show their like collection in like a video shoot like a digital runway where you can watch online or like they'll just like record the runway and you can just watch it all the time and I I wish I could have seen everyone's collection and that's what I'm most sad about is not being able to see my friends collections and not being able to like go through that with them so I'm doing the zombies because I feel like it suits my graduation story. Like, you get big brains and then graduate, but you don't get to go to graduation. And there's zombies. No, there's not. But I like zombies. And cyberpunk. Should that be a secret? I don't know. Get ready for that video. It's and we're like the Grizzlies and I didn't even know that either. I think in junior high we were the Grizzlies or elementary school. So it's like full circle. The first school I went to, Grizzlies. Last school I'm, I'm never gonna go to, Grizzlies. I'm never gonna go to school again. I wonder if anyone's like made a boss fight in a video game, but it's like a boss in like an office. <laughs> you like fight your boss at your work, your, the place you work at. I like want to sing Where Is My Mind by the Pixies, but then I only have the tune from Here Comes the Sun in my head. <laughs> uh, actually, kind of a pretty blue, kind of a gray color. I'm going to do some books with this. I like this one. And this one, I like this one. It smells good. I don't know how to draw books. There's like little rectangles. I'm gonna just like make the dress form burgundy because I have a burgundy dress form and like the ones at the school, which this is supposed to be my school, the dress forms are like muslin, so like the same color, like this like cotton fabric. I'm gonna have like a little brain up here. This is like brain mania. But like that's why you go to college, right? Your brain, okay? That makes sense to me. There's gonna be a little speech bubble right here in the center. And it's gonna have a little brain inside of it. Cotton candy? No. Brains. No, this thing zombies eat. All we wanna do is eat your brains. It's not reasonable. That's brain, yay, brain. Okay, here is a lesson on mixing paints. If you want like neutral colors, you just gotta mix all the colors together. I haven't even gotten yellow out yet. Which one was I gonna use? This one I think. That's kind of watery. So you take yellow, blue, and red, and you just mix them all together. And if you want a yellow brown, you add more yellow than the others. If you want a red brown, then you add more red than the others. If you want like a green brown, then you add more yellow and blue than red. If you want gray, you mix purple and yellow, or green and red, or blue and orange. Because those colors are exactly opposite, but if you mix the exact amount of all of them, then you get no color. Void color, but the same value. So it's not white or black, but it's gray. One thing I love about fashion is that I love color and drawing. 
So I love doing like fashion illustrations and like picking like amazing colorful printed fabric. The, the, the background could have definitely been thought out more. It's like, because I don't think I'm going to do a background at all and it's a mess, but it's a zombie apocalypse. We're all a mess in the zombie apocalypse. It's fun. It looks comic booky. It looks like a messy comic book done by an amateur. I want to look Dinstein. So in this scenario, I like graduated college and I got like this huge brain from college and then it was the zombie apocalypse and I was like, shit, now zombies will extra want to eat my brain. That's this part. I'm like, holy shit, I graduated and I have this Martian attacks brain. And now all the zombies are going to want to eat my brains extra more now. Okay. <sighs> Drawing Calista. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah. It's a lot of me. <laughs> I'm a narcissist. When I'm graduating, let me paint myself on my cap five times, four times. And this is a, a draw my life, except I'm drawing my, grad, my uh, college experience on my grad cap. And my college experience is getting a huge brain and fashion and lots of homework and then zombie apocalypse and I I'm just here with all my graduation stuff along in my house. <laughs> and my derby team turned into zombies. I miss derby. I want to do derby. Yeah, I went skating today in the cold. It was so cold out there. And there was this cute dog with like a LED collar and you could like see him in the dark. It was so cute. I've turned the whole table around so now you can see my face when I'm painting. Yeah, I'm like here whining about graduating when like COVID happened and we couldn't celebrate, but um other people are like going to school during this and it's way harder. Than what I had to do, so I shouldn't whine so much. Because it would suck to be going to school right now. Oh yeah, Crash is gonna be red too. It's okay. Like a lot of red, black, and white in this corner. That's fine. Clash at Demon Head. I did start reading The Walking Dead up to like this point, which is like the first like 10 pages, but okay, I, I like looked through the beginning of, I like started reading it at a friend's house and I did read this part and it was super spooky. I had actually already seen this show, so it wasn't like probably the impact it had if you were like reading it for the first time. But it was spooky and really cool and I liked the art. My handy dandy paintbrush. Let's mix the green. Let's mix some green. Yeah, this is a nice green, honestly. Okay. Chop it like vegetables. Chop, 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 chop. Chop like vegetables. Yes. The roller derby girls are in detention. Tea. Why are the derby girls in detention? My school doesn't have a derby team, but I did play derby in school, so. It's, um, this is an imagination land where I, I played derby on like a school team instead of just like not affiliated. That would be so fun. We're the slick derby girls. If you were a zombie, you would kick ass as roller derby because you wouldn't have to worry about injuries. Because you would be falling apart anyway. 
What if they were saying bran, like raisin bran? These are the healthiest zombies. This glasses is way too far out. These glasses are far out. My hair is thick even when it's in paint form. And I think I'm gonna just be naked because I I can't be bothered to design an outfit that doesn't like draw too much attention. So I'm gonna be naked, even though this is a fashion design channel. I'm gonna just paint hair and brains and exclamation points and not any clothes. <laughs> Your head will collapse and you'll ask yourself, where is my mind? Try this trick and spin it. Yeah. Your head will collapse and you'll ask yourself, where is my mind? Where is my mind? Where is my mind? Back to school. I took like a long time to get an associates of applied science, which is like, oh, I, I've looked it up and to like, kind of like boost my own ego, I've looked it up and it's close to the same credits as a bachelor's. And I think it's like more fashion credits as a bachelor's in fashion. Anyway, I like worked in like paid for it. Like I would just like pay for it all at once at the beginning of the semester, like the whole total of that semester, I would just like pay for it. Yes. <laughs> this is an intense graduation cap, let me just say. I feel like I could stop here, but I, why do I keep going? My glutton for punishment. Ah! Oh my god, I fucked it up. I fucked up a painting that was already bad. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you guys liked it. Like and subscribe.